Hollywood has witnessed many beautiful love stories turn into tragedies, but few relationships have been as complex and captivating to the public as the broken marriage between Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitt. Once the epitome of love and family, the two stars are now embroiled in years-long conflicts, ranging from child custody battles to legal disputes over assets. Most recently, at the 2024 Governor's Awards, Jo Lee appeared alongside her son Knox, once again bringing their story into the spotlight. The question arises, was the presence of 16-year-old Knox Jolie Pitt a carefully calculated move on Angelina Jolie's part? Angelina Jolie is one of Hollywood's most powerful icons, not only because of her beauty or acting talent, but also for how she has redefined her role. For Jo Lee, motherhood is not a responsibility, it is her reason for living. Speaking on Good Morning America, Jolie declared, You can take everything away from me, but don't touch my children. This statement wasn't just an emphasis. It was a bold declaration of how she prioritizes family above all else. She once paused her acting career for three years to spend more time with her children, and even when she returned to the screen with her role in Maria, she never stepped away from being a mother. For her portrayal of the legendary Maria Callas, Jolie had to learn opera singing. And during this time, her children embarked on a unique journey alongside her. Maddox, Paxthean, and their siblings each played a role in the film's development. Yet what stands out is that Jolie never pressures her children to follow in her footsteps. She consistently allows them the freedom to choose their own paths, whether that involves working behind the camera or leading a quiet private life. While Jolie often appears alongside her children at major events, Knox's appearance at the 2024 Governor's Awards held a special significance. This marked his first public appearance in three years. Following his attendance at the premiere of his mother's film Eternals, the moment mother and son walked the red carpet together was seen by the public as a beautiful symbol of familial love. However, for Brad Pitt, the event carried a different undertone. A source close to Pitt revealed that he believed Knox's appearance was a calculated move on Jolie's part. It's worth noting that the award ceremony took place just days after a judge ruled in Pitt's favor in the prolonged legal battle over Chateau Muraval, the couple's 350 $50 million dollars vineyard. Pitt reportedly suspected that Jolie deliberately brought Knox to the event to provoke him, turning what might have been a simple family moment into a subtle yet pointed challenge. Born into fame, Angelina Jolie's children, especially Shiloh, have been under the media spotlight from the moment they were born. Yet Jolie understands that fame is not always a gift. At times, it can be a cage that stifles the innocence of childhood. She once shared, I hope they find privacy as they grow older. Jolie doesn't just shield her children from prying eyes, but also encourages them to grow freely, without the weight of inheriting their parents' legacies. Maddox and Pax Thien, her two eldest, have chosen to stay behind the camera, working as assistant directors on her Maria project. Rather than living in their mother's shadow, they are carving out their own paths. The role of Maria Callas in Maria is more more than just Jolie's return to the big screen, it's a metaphor for her own life. Callas, an opera legend, lived a dazzling but lonely life, torn between love and career. To fully embody the character's tragedy, Jolie spent months learning opera singing. Reflecting on the early days of her vocal training at home, she laughed, my kids must have thought it was a nightmare listening to me practice. But for Jolie, this role was more than a performance, it was an opportunity for her children to see that their mother too could struggle, persevere, and sacrifice. Premiering at the 2024 Venice Film Festival, Maria received an eight-minute standing ovation. However, what made Jolie most proud wasn't the applause, but the collaborative journey she shared with her children. Maddox and Pax not only supported her, but also helped shape the story, turning the project into a family effort. For Jolie, this was a dream realized. Family is not just a place for love, but also a space for shared creativity. Angelina Jolie is one of the rare stars who has achieved both career success and deep family bonds. A three-time Golden Globe winner and an Oscar recipient, she has achieved it all. Yet, when faced with choices, Jolie always puts family first. Her decision to pause acting for three years to be with her children is a testament to her priorities. Even during her off years, Jolie created immense value writing books, directing films, and pursuing humanity humanitarian projects. For her, being a mother and an artist is not a balancing act, but an intertwined journey where every step enriches both her family and her work. Brad Pitt, once the epitome of charm and success in Hollywood, now faces challenges not only in his career, but also in his family life.
Since his divorce in 2016, Pitt has repeatedly expressed his desire to be more involved with his children, but his strained relationship with Angelina Jolie has often been a significant obstacle. Sources close to Pitt reveal that he feels hurt seeing his children spending less time with him. He suspects that Jolie used the governor's awards as an indirect way to further distance him from them. Brad finds it a little too coincidental that just days after a judge approved the trial over Chateau Mirival, Knox attended the awards ceremony with Angelina. The source shared, Pitt has reason to feel sidelined, especially as his conflict with Jolie has dragged on for years without resolution. This latest episode, coming on the heels of a pivotal legal development, only adds to the complexities of their long-standing feud. Behind the glamour of two Hollywood superstars lies a prolonged legal battle over the ownership of Chateau Mirival, a $350 million vineyard in France. Purchased by Brad Pitt and Angelina Jolie in 2008, the estate was transformed into a globally renowned wine brand under their joint stewardship. But as their love unraveled, Merval became a battleground for relentless disputes. In 2022, Brad Pitt filed a lawsuit against Angelina Jolie after she sold her 50% stake in the property to a Russian billionaire without informing him or giving him the opportunity to buy it back, something Pitt claims they had previously agreed upon verbally. Jolie, however, denies these allegations, asserting that she has full rights to manage her share of the property as she sees fit. The conflict escalated further when a Los Angeles Superior Court judge recently ruled in Pitt's favor, paving the way for the dispute to proceed to trial. Just days after this ruling, Angelina Jolie and her son Knox made headlines with their appearance at the Governor's Awards. Knox's re-emergence after years of absence sparked widespread attention, while speculation swirled around the timing and intent of Jolie's actions amid the ongoing legal drama. Despite the tension in their relationship, both Jolie and Pitt share one common bond, their love for their children. The question remains whether they can set aside their personal conflicts and prioritize the well-being of their family to create a more peaceful environment for their children. Time will tell, but one thing is certain. Their story will continue to captivate the public's attention for years to come.